Okay, so I'm this. Okay, I'm gonna pose for the. Got the thumbnail. Oh! Kunze, kunze. before you get your beads i wish i knew so much more before i get any my beads because honestly i was pretty lost and i wish someone told me this before but everything worked out for me but i just want to tell other people before they get their beads because i know beads are becoming real trendy right now so i just want to tell people what they should do before they get their beads one count your beads count your damn beads count your damn beads okay i counted all the braids i had i had 75 braids and i did four beads for per braid and i almost did not have enough beads for mine you hear this this is like the one albino like what's it called see the color it's just like white tan and pink so make sure you count your beads and make sure you have enough colors to go for all the beads so this is the pattern i chose which is the caramel pale brown then white this is not white it may seem white in the camera but this is pale or even sometimes it's pink so this is caramel pink or pale and then brown and then white so that's the pattern i chose pattern is not really like all that like i went there lady was like you want to do this pattern and i was like yeah i didn't want to do that pattern so make sure she does it all around i know one of them just messed up but I don't know which one. I think everything is okay. I don't know if I can find that one messed up one. Remember, there's one where it's like just like off. I don't know if I can find it. But like there was one that was off. So make sure you count your beads and you make sure all the beads can fill in your head. So be prepared for like around 50 to 100 braids depending on like your head. So I guess I had 75. So I guess I had 4 times 75. Put it up. That many beads make sure you come prepared Two, bring rubber bands i did not know i had to bring rubber bands but my mom did so lucky me three some beads have this little put up another photo have these little like needles that help you put in the beads make sure you get one pack of beads where they have that thing that thing was so useful and make sure you get at least two packs of those because those things break. I think I had like two of them break on me. My hairstylist said that it was like real easy to, it really helped her out to put them in the braids. Four, beads are not heavy. Beads are not heavy at all. Everybody's like, the beads are going to be heavy. The beads are going to be heavy. The beads are going to be heavy. They're not heavy at all. I know I have a lot. They're literally like plastic. People are like, it's going to be weighing down. They're not heavy at all. That's why I was scared and I got short. Short, it's shorter. Cover my side profile. Um, shorter than, um some other beads like normally braids are like really long but i think short beads are actually cuter than the long ones not for some people with long ones but i just think shortness my sister said the width of the beads match the length if that makes sense okay so beads are not heavy please don't let people be like beads are heavy they're not heavy at all they're not heavy at all i'm gonna come back and make another video because i don't really remember all the tips okay i got came back wrote everything down yeah so choose your color carefully so when you do get your colors i said i got brown because brown really matches with everything since it's just such a neutral color plus brown is still kind of in season now like it, it's it's really been in season longer than i thought it would be like because normally when trends come they really come and go but brown has really stayed in style and i really like brown because brown matches my skin it matches like really any outfit you put on so i would recommend you get brown maybe like an ombre of green or pink or maybe like even black or clear suggest that you get a color and then in your pattern you get white and don't just get one color because i think that's kind of boring i think you should do like an ombre or like a palette of colors you know try and do like even if you are going to do a simple one maybe do black white and clear or like black white and gray or something simple i wouldn't recommend you can't like it's not my hair but like i wouldn't recommend i would not recommend excuse me um Next, um, I yeah, as a normal YouTuber, I lost count or whatever. Kill me or something. You have no stealth. You're the loudest person in the room. These are loud. These are loud. You. That's why they probably put them on kids, so they always know where they are. They're like a cat with a bell. You're loud. You're like actually, you're really loud. You're so loud. Oh, oh, pipe down, bitch. Pipe <laughs> down. Like, you, shut up. <laughs> that's how loud you are. Just like, bro. I don't. This girl, she got beads. This is her. Okay. She got the really long beads that are clear and this is her. She's like, y'all look, look, look. 
And I was like, bro, shut up. Is that how I sounded when it reminded me? Shut up! Next, you will you will act like a boy with new growth or like a boy with locks on tick bro. This will be you. This will be you. This will be you. Isaac, shut the hell up! Put the flashing lights and then do this. Fight! Like literally we did that. Fight! It's actually really fun. We're just it's like really annoying. You act like a boy with new girls. Yeah. You want pizza? Yeah. He's like, what? You want pizza? Is that a yes or a no? Uh, whatever number this is. Number on the screen. You need to be careful when you first sleep because when I first started sleeping, I would get like indents on my on my neck and my back because I was sleeping on the beads. So make sure you do get a bonnet so it doesn't like ingrain your skin because it's kind of uncomfortable. It's kind of like getting base marks from your pillow or track marks, I think they're called. What's that pun? There's a pun where it's like, have you heard about the new corduroy pillows? They're making headlines. Like, that's literally the bees. The bees are making, like, marks on your face. So, with that, get a big bonnet. That's the next one. Get a big bonnet. Make sure the bonnet is, like... Like, I even bought a bonnet, and it's too small. So, I'm not to use it for now. Last tip. These bees are cute as hell, bro. These are the cutest bees I've ever had. This is, like, this hairstyle. I started, like, dressing out. I started acting different. Not in that way. Just, like, good, different. Like, I started changing these beads. You... When you have like a distinctive color of beads, you kind of get like pointed out. Like these is like, what's it called? I think like when you get a new hairstyle, it's kind of like your new signature. So you'll be easy to point out. You'll be easy to point out. Like people will be ready to spot you from a distance. They, will, they literally can hear you from a distance with your loud beads. So you'll be recognizable. Like you're kind of iconic. She's got a point. She's an icon. She's a legend. And she is the moment. Now come on now. I guess the last, 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 last tip is these things is cute. This thing is cute. Like these are really cute. They're really trendy and I really love this trend because I just love it. Like I didn't like faux locks too much because they got real popular real fast and I wasn't really into faux locks so they kind of all look the same. With these you can get your own different color, different length, different variations of patterns. And with faux locks I just feel like bro. I think I might get full locks. I even got another color. So next tip, I think you should get another color just in case you want to switch out the beads and change it up before you take out your hair. I'm not gonna do that, but I just got it. I think I might even like give those beads away because I just like this color a lot. I got another pink one and they're like huge. So here are the beads. Perfect. So these are the other beads I got. I was gonna switch them out, but I don't even want to switch them out. Like they just, I mean, these are really girly, and I just feel like they're just not for me. And like going through the effort of 75 beads, I don't think it is for me. I guess those are the 12 tips I got for getting beads. So now you know. Like the guy from teaching feng shui. So now you know. Of course, not all rooms are the same, but now you know. That's what I recommend before you get your beads. And I hope these tips were helpful. Peace out. Shut up, big old booty. Make it twerk. Make it twerk. Make it. That's been my song. Head in my head. In my, this been this song. This song has been in my head all day. Shut up, big old booty. Let me see you. Shut got a big old booty. Yeah. yeah. Twerk, yeah, take it out. Twerk, yeah, let me see on twerk. Uh -huh. Shotty got a big old booty. Uh -huh.